Well, I've done uh, several videos already about this uh, spider, uh, this uh, Cold Steel Voyager with its uh, uh, Snaggletooth tactical modification. Um, and I like the Snaggletooth so much, I ordered it for three other knives that I have. Um, the, uh, for anyone that doesn't know, the Snaggletooth uh, tactical uh, mod, uh, it allows a knife that would otherwise normally just be a conventional thumb stud knife to have something very similar to the Emerson Wave, uh, as seen on this Spyderco Enduro Wave. Um, and the way both the Wave and the Snaggletooth work is they're meant to catch in the corner of the pocket while you're drawing the knife, and you can open it extremely quickly. Uh, I'll demonstrate on my Formax Scout. Or my Cold Steel Counterpoint XL. It's a lot of knife to open really quickly. And on a big knife like this, the uh, pocket clip is so, much, so far away from the thumb stud that I found uh, you really have to quickly choke up on the knife to try to open it by the thumb stud. So I think on the, this big knife, having, a, uh, having the snaggle tooth really makes a huge difference. And I also added one to this uh, Ontario Rat 1. Uh, the Rat 1 is already a very flickable knife, so it, it just opens almost at the speed of thought. Uh, it really breathed new life into this old folder. Um, I've had a bunch of Ontario Rat 1s, by the way. Uh, they're great knives, but they're kind of outdated now, I think. Uh, I, I carried these things for years, so I've got several of them. I've given one or two of them away as well. But uh, Snaggletooth really uh, sort of, I'd say, is a little bit of a game changer, at least for me personally. Um, that's about it. This isn't at all a sponsored video. None of my content is. Uh, I, just, uh, I just like the product. Uh, here's their uh, sticker they gave me. Uh, you know, their website's just snaggletoothmf.com. Uh, but uh, that's about all. Have a good day.